For the next couple of videos we will use Smart Console in demo mode and I would recommend you to download and install Smart Console so you can do the same on your PC. To download Smart Console you don't need any account and it can be found on Checkpoint's website and I will link to the description below. When you have downloaded it just install it and you need to be administrator when you install the application. The application itself is about 500 meg to download and it requires 2 gigs of free disk space. So just install it like any other Windows application. When the application is installed, you can learn some more about the demo options. When it comes to R80, the demo version spins up a machine in the cloud, so internet connectivity is required. In the older version, like R77, the demo mode was purely local on your machine. As it is in the cloud machine, it's possible to do a few more things. And uh, there is an SK for this to see more about it. And that's SK 10 34 31. So if you want to start this in demo mode, just select demo mode and click next. When it comes to demo mode, you can either start a new demo or you can join an existing demo if you want to work together with some people. In this case, we will just create a new, a new demo. If you want more people to join to your demo, they can select join existing demo and select and put in this number. And then they will be able to connect to the same console or demo server that you are presently on. As it's the first time when you connect to the demo server, you need to accept the fingerprint. And this is something that you normally can verify in your own platform, but in a cloud environment, it's quite hard to verify it. So we just need to trust checkpoint in this case and press proceed. When smart console open, you will be presented with the new things within the release. And, um, this can be quite good guides to just see the difference of the different releases and there is actually links to a few YouTube clips that uh, may be interested for you as well. Thank you for watching and please consider to subscribe to the channel and I hope to see you in the next one. Take care. Bye.